Concerns growing for three missing London schoolgirls who have been smuggled into Syria from Turkey to join Islamic State militants. Our chief correspondent Richard Gaysford is outside their school in East London. So, Richard, good morning. Not clear what Britain or Turkey can do now to help, really, is it? Well, it would seem there's very little. The news that's come through is exactly what people here didn't want to hear. Scotland Yard have detectives on the ground. They seem to have some sort of evidence confirming that uh, Shamima Begum, who is 15, Khadiza Sultana, 16, and 15-year-old uh, Amira Abeze have now crossed into Turkey. That is confirming reports from people smugglers who seem to recognize the girls from pictures having crossed in the last few days. And that border region is incredibly difficult and dangerous, and they would really need to have specific intelligence now as to where the girls were should they wish and it would seem unlikely to launch some sort of special forces mission to go and get them and uh, questions too as to whether even if the girls change their mind once they've got into Syria whether the people they've gone with would allow them to return over the border there is evidence Kate coming through all the time of the kind of messages that they may well have received from other female jihadists in Syria and that goes some way to explaining perhaps the absolute bafflement of a teacher I've spoken to here who says he can't I can't believe that three girls that he taught for a year, intelligent girls, could be radicalised in that way. Thank you very much indeed, Richard.